Okay. UFO power source. Oh, right. More alloys. A lot more alloys. Excellent. I'm going to do some editing. Okay. Need to reset my timer and start. Okay. <sighs> Scope. When equipped, this advanced targeting module integrates with XCOM's active HUD system to offer a significant increase to our soldiers' aim. Ooh. Alien nav computer. UFO power source. This compact device is somehow responsible for generating the enormous amounts of power consumed by. Well, hang on, what's that? Beam weapons? Hang on, light plasma rifle. This carbine-style weapon is capable of generating a direct superheated charge of plasma. Further research could allow for this technology to work in our favor. Or beam weapons. Hmm. Um, let's see. I appreciate your efforts to support the research team, Commander. I've already put the new recruits to work in the lab. See the changes I did early. Aim is now plus ten. Nice. Okay. The foundry is almost done. time in the foundry? It's not the prettiest, but some of our more interesting projects will certainly benefit from the adjustments super made down heavy here. heavy infantry vehicle is an unmanned combat drone that could take the place of an XCOM soldier. Once this project is completed, we can 
begin building shiv units in engineering. Improved pistol. One of our earliest developments in foundry, the magnetic ordnance reduction system, greatly reduces the recoil of our entire range of sidearms. Utilizing the latest in composite materials, this upgrade will significantly improve the odds of our soldiers scoring critical hits on their targets. Cool. The portable targeting module called Scope could be upgraded to highlight sensitive points on enemy targets. We believe that the chance of critical shots would increase accordingly. Yeah, let's do that. Seven days. And... Let's do that. Nice. I'll send word to the Foundry crews now. You can follow their progress remotely from the project queue in engineering. Nice. They're gonna finish in the exact same time? Are you serious? Dude, it's awesome! <laughs> I'm gonna take a robot with me. Awesome. Awesome. Yeah, let's go to engineering, see how much this, uh... See how much the what's this? Alloy shiv. Oh, I see. Okay. Five engineers in one barracks capacity. Super heavy infantry vehicle or shiv is an advanced weapons platform that can be deployed in place of a human soldier while extremely capable in most combat scenarios. Any damage to the ship will require length, lengthy repairs. Let's do an alloy ship. Integration of the alien alloy to the basic ship design results in a weapons platform that is both lighter and stronger than the original. Okay. Let's manufacture some. I think maybe two. Two's enough. Uh, hang on, a hundred point. Expensive. Yeah, let's just take one for now. Ah, it's seven days to build it, huh? <laughs> All right, not a problem. Commander, we have multiple reports of new abductions in progress. The locations are marked on the hologlobe. Four scientists. Four engineers. Russia. Yeah, let's do that. We don't want to lose Asia completely. Now do we? Rogar. I told you. Care of his armor. Alright. strike one. Here we go. You'll be heading into Japan for the next mission. We've picked up a local broadcast indicating alien activity within a major metropolitan area. We should get down there and eliminate any hostiles. Strike one is cleared to engage. Yeah. Oh, that's nice. Alright, let's see what we got going. Hello. Didn't I just get squats out on Merlin? Um, can't see them anymore. No 
that's why. <laughs> Could explain it. Alright. That's gonna move on. Not yellow. And ferret. Last but definitely not least. Lagging. You know what that means? Computer memory is full. <laughs> 